SNL, Reap Davidson raps an ode to Stanley Tucci played by Sam Rockwell and its genius. Tucci Gang. Where you at? Reap Davidson and host Sam Rockwell just paid tribute to fellow actor Stanley Tucci in the best way possible, with a hip-hop anthem. Head here for all the details. Okay, the comedy powerhouse behind Saturday Night Live just outdid themselves. Reap Davidson, 24, took on rapper alter ego Lil Pump to perform the rousing homage to Stanley Tucci. Haven't heard of him? No worries. Lil Pump and host Sam Rockwell, 49, are here to educate you. The pair danced their way through a high school while dropping some knowledge on just what makes Stanley Tucci so great. Here's a choice lyric, some of you don't know the no, that's that guy from The Hunger Games. Transformer, The Last Night, Beauty and the Beast in Spotlight. How about this gem, I got mad respect for his range, he should have Doctor Strange. The Devil Wears Prada was sick. If you don't like Stan, you're a dick. It's random and weird and wonderful. Check out loads more images from season 43 of the hit comedy show right here. If you tuned in at all in 2017, then you know that SNL has not shied away from the serious hot-button issues in America and has earned a reputation for sharp comedy in response to troubling political and social issues. Take for instance, when the largely vilified Republican tax plan was about to pass in December Michael Che, 34, commented on Weekend Update that, now that President Donald Trump, 71, has served his purpose, his days are numbered. You know once they get this tax bill passed, they won't need Trump anymore, he said. They already got what they wanted. I mean. It's not like they like you. Don't you think it's a little odd that they passed this bill at 2 a.m. the same night they found out Flynn was snitching on you? They know something. But our favorite sketch of the year has to be when Michael decided to go undercover as a liberal white girl to better understand their way of like. To do this, he donned a blonde wig and became Gretchen. He read a Lena Dunham book, he got brunch with friends and he shut down a man when he decided to start mansplaining. When a guy at a dinner party tried to argue that white people struggle as much as any demographic, Gretchen lost her cool. Your masculinity is mad toxic right now, my knee A. Eh? Michael replied. Love it. Hollywood lifers, what did you think? Did you love that sketch or not? Let us know in the comments section below.